Hi everybody, welcome to Otaku Saga. I'm Rizzo. And I'm DK, and on this episode of the Fan Reaction, we watch episode 10 of Bokuban. Alrighty, let's get to it. Mm. Starting in... 3, 2, 1... Let's, let's jam! jam. Unfamiliar ceiling. It is, though. Remember, she lives with you now. Yeah, we just made them just now. And the thing is, apart from the sister, I t totally believe they all agree to it. <laughs> Mama Sama? She did not say Miss Yuiga. No, she did not. Mm. Sneaky, sneaky. Already calling her Mama. Okay. Well then, they're all alone in the house. I'm presuming it's a weekend. Oh boy. For all the Furuhashi fans out there, this one's for you. Ooh. <laughs> Aww. Aww. Honey, I shrunk the waifu. <laughs> yeah, this girl I had Pat. Also, how many times did she ding her hands? Damn. Oh, smooth. You want to know what else is hard and salty? <laughs> That's right, these eggs. How do you do that? <laughs> oh, now he's trying to let her off easy. <laughs> Bullshit. But I uh... know. <laughs> oh, <laughs> that's a big ass thing of noodles. No. I think it was showing that they were overdone. And now it's going to get weirder. <laughs> How do you make your, the sound like that with your lips pursed like this? <laughs> Damn, he's not hes not holding back anymore. I was saying mm. something. Yes. Oh. 
underneath. Ah, school swimsuit. Ah. <laughs> <sighs> actually more muscular than I thought. <laughs> Oof. You have a boner, don't you? Say that for the dojins. She about to pass out. This ain't that kind of series. Yup! And then they fucked. <clears throat> then he put her in bed. <laughs> the what? fuck was that sound effect? <laughs> Someone really far away from the prying eyes of my family. She's giggling. Just Hard to believe we're right in the middle of Tokyo still. Right. All right, wait. Have they really like dropped a location? Cl oh. No, they they really haven't. But yeah. also that arrow. What a nerd. Furuhashi.exe has stopped working. Oh, 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 hey! 
Come on. Chicken to an awkward landing. Come on. Oh. Okay. My. How lewd. Kind of like your passion for life. Pause. Mm. It couldn't be that easy. She already what? She already got in. <laughs> nice plot twist.
<laughs> it goes like this for some time. Mm. My life is a lie. Oh. She held on to him. What was the third thing? And what was the password? <laughs> I'm going to jail! <laughs> Worth it. Of course the dits lose it running. Oof. Oh, Ow. right in the Kogoro. <sighs> oof. Big oof. There it is. Oh boy. Mm, yeah. Even though you're sitting right across from me. Alright. I don't like where this music's going. No. <laughs> Deal with it. I know. Soon. Ah! <laughs> God damn! Vanilla goodness. Ha <laughs> 
But for their family... Soon, soon. <laughs> oh. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Don't do it. <laughs> I don't have to say a thing. <laughs> mm. Oh, shit! Uh-oh. You're gonna give Naryuki the business. <laughs> Answer carefully. Your life may depend on it. Damn near lethal dose of Furuhashi. Ah, oh, good stuff. <laughs> ah, jeez. Also, yeah, nice uh, twist on the old lean on the shoulder cliche. Right. Well, I'm awake. I am totally aware of what I'm doing. Yelp. If that ain't a sign. She can deny it all she wants. Mm. Well, no, now that Papa's on board, Papa knows what's up, too. Festival arc, huh? Oh, uh, yeah, the festival arc. Oh. So the arc guess. that I was worried that they weren't going to get to, actually. Well, they got a couple episodes to do so. <clears throat> yeah. Or at least to start it off. <sighs> I remember you mentioning it, that it's kind of a long arc. Well, it is, but I, I could probably see them getting through it in a couple episodes. Mm -hmm. But, yeah, what a, what a great... Um, I guess, uh, I don't want to necessarily say backstory arc, but kind of just character arc for, uh, Fumino. Yeah. I mean, especially after, you know, uh, I guess, I mean, as featured up until this point. Right. I mean, there's, there's always still the thing of her not really admitting mm. her feelings for Naruki. Well, that's understandable yeah, that, because, of like, until like very recently in the story, those feelings have been, I guess, very slowly developing. Right. I mean, she's been in conflict with herself over the, you know, this whole time, unlike, say, Uruka, who's been head over heels for the guy since forever. Right. But. But I mean, there's also the fact that she knows that her two best friends also like the guy, mm -hmm. and so she doesn't want to uh, right. be that person. Yeah. Well, and then like a 
school festival arc to, uh, I guess, drive further romantic conflict, right? The school, the school festival arc should be pretty good. Oh, man. So. If it's any as good as this uh, Furuhashi arc has been, that's a good sign. So, yeah, again, I mean, for fans of the character, wow, here you go. Welcome to the uh, show. Honestly, I think that the Furuhashi, like, arc as a, as a character development arc or as a backstory arc was probably the best one on the series. Well, it's definitely the one with the most drama. Yeah. I mean, jeez. You know, you get to the end of that end of the little uh, video her mom made on her deathbed, and she wants to name the star after her dad. That's just ah, it was like one of Pando uh, Commando, you know, from B Star. One of his bolted right to your heart, right there. Huh? Just straight up. No oh hesitation. my heart! Oh, oh. <laughs> that was no, that was that was a, that was a feels trip and a half. Yeah, that's good stuff. So, but yeah, so. <clears throat> anyway, that about does it for episode 10 mm. of Boku Ben. But as always, I'm Rizzo. And I'm DK. See you, See you next time. time.